eels. Renowned chef Raymond Blanc recalls visiting Japan and eating a plate of live baby eels at a local eatery. We were advised to add vinegar and sake, which made them jump around, then you swallowed them whole. Which Eddie Grubbs? Protein can be scarce in the Australian outback, which has led to the tradition of eating witch eddy grubs, with some folks popping the squirming bugs like their popcorn. Nutrition-wise, 10 witch eddy grubs are said to fulfill your daily requirement of protein. Lobster. You're probably thinking that lobsters are boiled alive and are deceased by the time they make it to your plate, and you'd be right. New York City restaurant Azuma Kirby, however, is one of several eateries that actually serves lobsters while they're still alive, with diners invited to pick belly sashimi out of the lobster, which is still moving around while it's served. Sea urchin Sea urchins are undoubtedly an acquired taste, but those who do enjoy urchin know the best way to eat them, is right out of the shell while they're still alive. Drunken Shrimp A delicacy in China, this dish involves soaking live shrimp in a booze-heavy broth that the thirsty crustaceans slurp up, making them both tipsy and tasty. Drunken Shrimp is traditionally served in a special glass goblet with a lid, to prevent the twitching, thrashing shrimp from jumping onto your lap. Cobra In Vietnam, it's considered a delicacy to slice into a live cobra, rip out its heart and eat it while it's still beating. Gordon Ramsay tried it once, although it didn't seem like he was too thrilled about it. Ants Noma, is internationally famous for using live ants as a type of seasoning, which supposedly lend a zesty flavor to its signature salad. Kesumarzu. Kesumarzu is certainly a more appetizing moniker than its nickname, rotten cheese. In fact, this traditional Sardinian cheese contains a special ingredient you won't find in most cheese, maggots. That's because after the cheese forms, it's left outside with a hole cut in the top to allow flies to enter, laying eggs that become larvae that eat the cheese and then excrete some sort of cheesy deliciousness. Not only are you eating live maggots, you're also eating their poop. Akaizakuri Translated from Japanese, Akaizakuri literally means prepared alive, and although the cooking technique can be performed with various critters, the most popular is fish. When fish comes Akaizakuri style, it's filleted without being killed, served while the heart is still beating and the fish's mouth continues to open and close. Sometimes the half-sliced fish is returned to the tank to swim around, until it's time to be served up for a second course. Odori Don Odori Don is squid that's technically dead when it's served. However, there's a reason why it's also known as dancing squid. When soy sauce is poured on a dead cuttlefish squid, it seemingly comes back to life, lifting up off the bowl while its tentacles twitch. The reason has to do with the chemical reaction from the salt in the soy sauce, which triggers electrical impulses in the tissue, which is still alive even though its brain isn't. Thank you for watching. If you enjoy this video press the like button, leave a comment letting us know what you think, and subscribe if you haven't already.